Hey guys, and welcome to A Cheap Beast. Now, I know a lot of people do this, but for me, you look at this team, you think, what the hell are you doing, Housen? What is this cheap beast? And then you look at the player, Abubakar. He is outstanding. 23 games in 10... 23 goals in 10 games. 1,300 coins. Them stats, plus he's 6 foot high and his med high medium work rates. Yes, he only has that three-star skill moves, but he is so good. He may not look like the best, but a lot of people liked him last year because of obviously he was a he was a non-rare card and he was really overpowered. But this year, considering it's about when you've got a player with strength and pace and can shoot, he is basically the god of FIFA. Now, obviously, Kone will be always god, but he's partner. Look at him. Look at them. I've actually played with this team around him, and I've scored that many goals. It's not like I'm assisting him with Inform Payet or Messi or something. I'm assisting him with a 45-rated striker. It's, like, absolutely insane. Also, this team is really good, so <laughs> go build it. But seriously, guys, this guy's absolutely crazy. Now, we're going to get some clips. Now, we're into the clips, and you'll see right from the kick start that beauty right there. Get that out of the net. This is the sort of thing he can do. Right at the beginning, he's doing an overhead kick. Now, this is the first and probably the best goal I have scored already. And it's not even been too... Da it's been a few hours into the proper game, obviously. I've got the game now. But it's absolutely insane. The power. Look at it. The pure power. Obviously, that better camera angle. It went at the goalkeeper. But the power of the shot could not stop it. But where he has so much pace, he has 85 pace for a guy who's got... 81 physical as well, and he's 6 foot. He just runs like a wrecking ball. He's the machine of the team. You play a ball through, he's more than likely to get onto the end of it because of that 85 pace. Now, pace isn't much of a factor in this game, but for me, I feel like this guy is just... He's something else. When you do a few ball rolls to get around the fence, he just does ball rolls as if they were just, like, walking past players. Look at the pace. He just runs past people. Finesse goal. Look at that. Easy, simple. It's so, so simple to run with this guy. He, Even though he only has 75 dribbling, the ball seems to be glued to his feet. Now his finishing could work a little bit better. Obviously, we're obviously taking quite tight angle shots, but he does have that power to, obviously, when the defence are holding him off, he does have that power shot to just hit it wherever he wants, and more than likely, it's going to go in. He didn't score 23 goals in 10 games for no reason. He just holds defenders off so well. When he wants to hold them off, he'll just run players through the roof. Because literally, he just runs them. Watch, this is a perfect example. Just runs and runs. He just breaks through two defenders right there. Ball rolls it past them. And then a finesse in. And now, where do you find a striker that's 1,300 coins that can do something like that? That's the type of things you'd expect Messi and Ronaldo to do. And literally... Bit disappointed, obviously, he's only got three star skill moves, but I just could not stop doing ball rolls with him. His ball rolls were insane. Just the way he, he's so like he's like Ben Teke, except a faster version and a much cheaper version. The way you can run with the ball, he's got close good control of the ball, and like he just look at that, just walking through players. Ball roll, and then obviously not the best finish, probably could have put that in the back of the net, but he always is on the last man. He's always like waiting for that run, obviously, because I play a quite high line on my attack, and obviously I sit on that last man because I like to break through, and he is perfect for this sort of example, because obviously where he's got the pace, he can just run through, and he's literally, it's like I said in the Diego Costa, like... He just holds people off. He puts a brick wall behind him so no defender who's behind him can get back in front of him. And look at that. I feel like it's just absolutely disgusting. Defender's sliding in left, right and centre. He's just running at him. And he just keeps running. Keeps running. Beautiful throw ball. He doesn't stop. Doesn't turn around. If he doesn't finish it the first time, he's got the rebound. He's just an absolute beast. Look at this. He just doesn't stop running. Obviously there. Another great finish. Showing his technical ability that he can't just punish him in like a great shot he can also just like finesse it in gently and we're going to go back to this goal to me I think this is an absolute wonder goal like seriously I could not believe my eyes when I actually saw it I was like I just I was just gobsmacked like he, he pulled it out of the bag out of nowhere like the ball just dropped in it's the first corner I've scored in FIFA 16 and it's an overhead kick from there it's not like it's just on the six yard box it's just coming up to the line of the 12 yard now guys if you have enjoyed this video and you do want to smash that like button, that'd be absolutely amazing. Subscribe if you're new around here for more FIFA 16 content, and I do hope to see you next time. Goodbye.